Hello, crypto family. Welcome back to another video where I'm bringing those daily crypto news articles. Today's article is the next Bitcoin happening is two years away. Here is why it matters. We are halfway through the four-year Bitcoin halving cycle, as the fourth time mining rewards will be halved approaches in 2024. We examine how it will affect Bitcoin. And that's right. So the six Bitcoins going to be cut in half for daily rewards. But online debate around the upcoming Bitcoin halving event is heating up. Those discussing it are delighted that the cryptocurrency community only has approximately two years before this event, leaving many outsiders asking, what is it and why is it so crucial? According to Coinmetrics State of the Network email newsletter dated April 19th, Bitcoin is reaching its fourth happening event or the fourth protocol designed 50% drop in block rewards that occurs every 210,000 blocks or about every four years. Here's the chart of that when it's supposed to be happening. Now, the next happening event is expected to occur around May 4th, 2024, when Bitcoin hits 840,000 blocks. Because there are 744 days until this happens, we are halfway between the third and fourth happening occurrences. Happening events are significant because they diminish the incentives given to miners for mining Bitcoin, which involves verifying new transactions and putting new currencies into circulation. Now, what will take place on May 4th, 2024? Well, I'll definitely be watching a bunch of Star Wars films because may the 4th be with you. <laughs> but jokes aside, in the current era, which follows the third happening event on May 11th, 2021, the miner receives a fee of 6.25 Bitcoin for each Bitcoin block mined, taking the daily average of 144 blocks, indicates that around 900 BTC is now issued and awarded every single day. The fourth happening event will half this reward and lower it to 3.125 Bitcoin every block. If the daily average of blocks remains the same roughly, 450 BTC will be released in its rewards every day. So yeah, so as of right now, instead of 900 new Bitcoin hitting the market every day, two years from now, we will be minting only 450 uh, new coins every day. Now, this is huge because simple business economics, supply and demand, you're taking away the supply of new coins but the demand for Bitcoin has never been higher. So and in two years, it's just going to be even higher than that, making it even more valuable. Now, what effect will the fourth halving event have? After the 19th million Bitcoin block, 73 or 730,002 was mined on April 1st. It became evident that just 2 million Bitcoin remain out of the 21 million Bitcoin limit. Reduced supply usually leads to increased demand, which implies that prices may rise. In the past, Bitcoin halvings events have been followed by gradual and significant price rises over time, accumulating within one and a half years. If the same thing happens with the next one, Bitcoin investors will be pleased. And that is true. Like if we can make it to the uh, 100,000 mark, oh man, then like this happening in the two years could potentially push it to a half a million coin at that point. Just studying the uh, traditional Bitcoin stock to flow model, which is usually fairly accurate, like we should be at the 100,000 right now, but we are still very close. Like it's still the beginning. So we'll see what happens. But yeah, this is why the happening is so important, why we need to be educated on it. If you can't keep creating an infinite amount of Bitcoin, there's only 21 million. 19 million has been created. Let's just say set 20% of that is lost forever. So Bitcoin is very scarce and that's what's giving it true value and why so many countries and governments want it. Because also it's a one crypto that hasn't been hacked in over 13 years now. So it's holding the time. <laughs> so yeah, good article. Hope you guys got something from it. If so, hit that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss a beat, share this with your friends. And until next time, the Crypto Sherpa is out.